What up, ladies and gentlemen? This your boy SK the King coming in with another reaction video. And today we actually gonna be checking out CJ the Champ video of Majin Buu the Ultimate Menace. So let's check it out, man. She walks up to this man and slaps him in the face. Mm. So then Boo looks at her and he says, Do you like eggs? It turns her into a literal egg. I remember like, I that. Like scramble. <laughs> Damn. Yeah, he got a cold ass intro though, man. Menaces. Truly terrifying creatures. <laughs> the rarest breed of the anime character in today's society. Their ignorance, disrespect, mm. and disregard for human life is just unmatched. That is why we made a round table for these rare breeds of menaces. <laughs> and the person leading that charge is a little pink ass <laughs> This absolute <laughs> menace, absolute demon, the yeah. ultimate black air force, Majin Buu. This thing is the <laughs> ultimate personification of a hood. Like, this ain't even like a black air force. This is a black Tim, a <laughs> Fila, a Shaq, a damn Fubu. <laughs> this is just absolutely terrifying. There's a reason he's at the front. So, uh, y'all already know your boy got the evidence on deck. And then it's finally time to observe the ultimate menace. So, without further ado. <clears throat> Let's get it. Exhibit A. Hi, ladies and gentlemen. So as we know, Majin Buu has multiple various forms. And mm -hmm. at each form, he gets even worse, worse, to just outright what the f***. So obviously, we have to start from the beginning. So I present to you Exhibit A, Fat Buu. So as <laughs> we know, Goku and Vegeta are fighting right now, and that's giving all the energy for Buu to wake up. So when Buu hatches out his shell and everybody sees him, everybody's looking like, you telling me this fat ass Captain D's Patrick Star Kirby looking motherfucker is a terror of the universe? <laughs> you gotta be kidding, right? Like, look at him, he's waddling. Yeah, that's what so I thought too. Looking at Bobby like, really, my boy, you was really hyping all this up? <laughs> what a pity. So then Boo looks over at him and he's like, boy, I know you ain't talking sh with that receding ass hairline. Like, God damn, <laughs> of Vegeta's. So then Boo Bro. starts steaming. And then he smiles at him and he swings and gouges mm. out his eyes. Damn! out the demon king with the kick. Look at Gohan. He like damn. That's tough. Whole three episode fight with this man, and he just kicked him like a rag doll. Ah hell no! I'm the go. So why are you flying? Boonin already caught him. Like oh, where y'all think y'all going? The fuck just started. Look at Supreme Kai. He like oh my god. I'm about to die. Man, Street slapped his <laughs> Oh face. my god. He started beating the mm. brakes off of his ass. Then this man comes from the top rope like the big show and sits mm. on his ass. His ribs, his organs, his spine. Oh my <laughs> <laughs> comes in and tries to stop him, but who said, get your bum ass out my side. Oh, -hoo -hoo. oh Damn. Come <laughs> on, sit my boy flying. So then Dabor comes back and tries to lay the hands on him again, but he literally mm -hmm. turns this man into a cookie. And Damn. And he's kind of devours this. Damn. Fight. Oh, no, nah, bro. This man literally just turned the Demon King into a damn gingerbread man and devoured him in one bite. So then Vegeta pulls up, but... <laughs> come on, mm -mm -mm. Y all, It's Vegeta. I ain't even gonna lie to y'all. <laughs> Vegeta's my favorite character, and I already knew he was gonna get his ass beat. So he wraps Damn. him up and traps him. And look at him skipping. He's like, hippity do down. <laughs> Yippee! Here we go! Boom! <laughs> booted man. Then he comes from the top rope again. And <laughs> Damn! 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 Might as well just blow myself up then. Drugs. I the remember that blood. too. To be honest with you, mm. you were an accident. Damn. And that man Vegeta is 
Literally. <laughs> or so we thought. This man really rebuilt himself and he is still kicking, bro. Damn. So this just goes on Did that for nothing. Range. They went to this one city, so he's like, all right, everybody bring that up. So then he's like, all right, what I'm going to eat? Cake or candy? Candy. So he turns everybody in that city into bro. candy. Bro. started inhaling them like Kirby. Just really Dang. Up this entire hey, everybody, bro. Seconds. He decided to spit it out. And bro just <laughs> laid out the entire city. Then he went Damn. to the next one. Lifted him up and turned every single one of them into a chocolate bar. So after this, Goku finally pulled up and pulled out SS3. After, you know, like, screaming his ass off for, like, the entirety of the damn episode. And was damn. Like he was taking the fattest dude of his life. <laughs> Goku was beating the brace off his ass, though. Man grabbed him by his antenna and started playing paddle ball with him. Look at him. Look like he is doing this with no effort. Then he throws damn. him into an entire building. Bro, Goku, bro. I thought you was all about saving the people of Earth, but apparently not. Bro, mm -mm. chucked him into a bunch of innocent people and chucked him into a whole building with probably people still in it. And look at him, he's like, man, f*** them. We'll push him back with the Dragon Balls. So they oh. go and down and he's like, all right, listen, my boy. I'm about to run out of time, so I got a proposition for you. Wait two days, and there's going to be a warrior that's going to want to box you. And also, stop listening to that bum-ass chameleon. Like, for real, my boy, you're awesome. So I could go through this. Damn. Like, man, you know what? He was right. So he grabs him and punches his head off. Punches his lights out. Choked him and blew him to smithereens. Mm. Look at him, he's like, ah, yes. <laughs> Boo, free man. Hip, hip, hooray, no more bum-ass chameleon. <laughs> he's flying around and then he's like, ugh. You get tired, man. So he stops in the middle of the road in front of this truck. So the dude in the truck like, hey, get your oh, fat ass man. up the road, huh? So Boo turns around and he says, Mr. I have a question. Am I handsome? Then the dude in the truck like, hell no, nah, nigga, you get no bitches. Now get the fuck out of here. He's like, sit your stupid ass oh. up. Oh. nigga, got shit on me. So then he says, you know what? This is a good spot for a house. So he lifts everybody up, turns them into Play-Doh, and builds a literal house. Oh, and man. And he's on creative mode at this point. So after this, Boo continues his That's crazy, game. bro. So he sees these boats, and he's like, hmm, Boo play with the boats. So this man starts skating on the water, and bro blasted through the ship. So Damn. So he's drowning, so then he grabs on the Boo. And Boo's looking at him like, nigga. Get your bitch <laughs> 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 So then Damn. goes up and you already know this man talking shit. Man, it's like, you fat Captain D's Big Mac number one combo bitch ass. Oh, don't think I'm done. Oh, Pillsbury dope boy looking ass. Oh, 2012. Yeah, Damn. Can't hold me back. Rick Ross looking ass. But, but y'all oh. know who's not having that disrespect. So we just started beating the bricks off his little ass. Mm. Like, Stop playing with me. Then he picks him up. He's like, oh yeah. He was talking about that good a second ago. And now look at you. Mm. Mm. Oh, Damn. And that boy to the shadow room. So then after this, Mr. Satan pulls up. And they actually become friends. So they outside playing with this dog, and this hunter ends up shooting the dog. Oh. Mm. So Boo's like, what, what, what is this debauchery? Am I feeling some type of sympathy right now? Absurd. Oh, so yeah. After this, Boo Boo's starts pissed. steaming again. And then he shoots out this cloud, and in that cloud mm. is another <clears throat> Boo, but he's skinny and he's gray. Then he walks up to him and he's like, hey, nigga, did I just catch you feeling some type of sympathy? Oh, know. man. So he starts punishing this man. No. He absolutely breaks off of him. So Boo shoots his beam at him, but bro blows it away and it hits him and it turns into chocolate. Damn. And bro just ate it. And then he starts to transform. So yeah, that was Exhibit A and it's time yeah. to move on to Exhibit B. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Right, Straight minutes, man. Exhibit B. Super Boo. So as we can see, Boo has turned into Super Boo. And this is where it just started to get outlandish. So the first thing that this man does is jump in homie's mouth. Oh. No life for life. This is like actually disgusting. I'm not showing this. 
But anyway, so he ends up blasting off to the lookout. So when he gets to the lookout, he's like, all right, listen up. I was promised a fight two days ago that there's going to be some strong ass. So produce that ass. Come on now, chop, chop. Don't be shy. So Piccolo ends up making a grave mistake. So Goten and Trunks aren't ready to fight. So he ends up saying, there's plenty of other people on Earth that you can kill for your amusement while you wait. So Boo's like, all right, bet. So he starts walking yeah. around the lookout. He did. Surveying how many humans are left alive right now. So after he's done, he lifts up his hand and uses human extinction attack. And he straight up deletes the entire human population. Yeah. Savage. Done, he's like, all right, I'm done. Now bring that ass. So Piccolo's like, all right, listen, listen, my boy. Just give us one hour. That's all we need. And Bro's like, an hour? Hell no. So then Fidel starts talking. She's like, it's just an hour. I hope you're not scared. Oh, you're a chicken. The boy <laughs> looks at her. He's like, shut your stupid ass up with that cell soccer Gohan cut you got going on right oh. now. Oh. Like, I should just kill you. So then Piccolo's like, yo, just chill out, bro. Just wait the hour. So about five minutes later, while Boo's waiting, Chi Chi does one of the dumbest things I have ever seen. Oh no! She walks up to this man and slaps him. In oh the my face. God! So no, looks at her that's and not says, good. Do you like eggs? And turns her into a literal egg. And he said, "I like my scramble." Oh. Mm. God, he literally turned Damn. her into an egg and stomped her like a roach in front of her son oh my god bro about half the time passes now and boo's like you know what i'm done with this wait bring that ass now people was like bro it's only been 30 minutes I was like, I, 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 i'm done with this if i don't get this fade right now i'm deleting all y'all so piccolo takes him to the hyperbolic time chamber so he can fight go tank so he's back there and he's like really these little goofy ass niggas I bet then. So they start to do the fusion dance, but Boo blitz his trunks and sucks. Mm. So Trunks is like, yo, bro, chill. How you gonna attack a that's Transformer, bro? That's anime rule number one. You just committed taboo. So when they finally fuse, Boo's like, oh, it's you. I already ran your fade once, but <laughs> I guess I'll do it again. Oh yeah, bro. Boo was just bullying him again. Yeah. He straight up jungle the man since yeah. him all the way back to he the did. Like, look at man's bro, he's just chilling, living his best life. Well, after this, Piccolo ends up destroying the hyperbolic time chamber. So he's like, ha now nobody can get out of here. So Boo's like, ain't no way, boy. boy, ain't no way, boy. If I'm stuck <laughs> in here, I ain't getting no more candy. Oh, now this just won't do. So this man literally screamed a hole and teared open the dimension. So he yeah. straight up slithered away. So he comes back outside and starts looking at everybody. And then he says, Chocolate, chocolate, chocolate. Yeah. Chocolate. Got everybody. We just turned the entire cast into chocolate. Burn straight up devoured their souls. So later on, when he's fighting Golden Skin, they end up unfusing. So Bro just fell asleep. Bro said it ain't even worth it at this <laughs> point. So then. Ultimate Gohan pulls up. And, and this man wanted all the smoke. But straight up stared homie down and said, I'm gonna kill you. And he started laying mm. three hands on me. Damn. Looking like he was fighting Cell again. But, of course it didn't last long. Man straight up absorbed Gotenks and Piccolo. And Gohan oh, literally sat man. there and watched him do it. So then after this, it was Raps, bro. He was beating the brakes off of Gohan. So then TN shows up. <laughs> TN. I'm sorry, I can't take this bro. seriously. <laughs> TN? <laughs> bro, get your ass out of here. And then bro just ended up absorbing Gohan too. So then he ends up smacking around Goku and Vegeta like they said damn ragdolls. So then they have to resort to using Vegeta. Man, oh man. This was an undeniable ass whooping. Mm. Vegeta was smacking him the fuck up. Like mm. this wasn't even funny. So after Goku and Vegeta beat the brakes off of Boo and rescue everybody that he's absorbed, he starts to transform again. And dear God, it's time for Exhibit C. So, without further ado, Exhibit C. Mm-hmm. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we have finally reached the climax. And Lord have mercy, may God help us all. Exhibit C consists of Kid Boo. Yeah. As you can see, Boo is transforming right now from this really big buff form. 
And Supreme Kai is losing his mind right now. He's like, oh my god. Oh my god, it's him. And there he is, ladies and gentlemen. The ultimate yeah. black air force. No, 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 let me not even say that. The ultimate menace. Kid, <laughs> boom. So the yeah. kid's like, look, Kakarot, the little got smaller. And they hella confident right now. So while this is happening, Supreme Kai is having PTSD right now. Bro's like, yo, this is the dude that killed all of the Kais. West Kai, gone. North Kai, gone. Yeah. South Kai, cobbled up. Grand Supreme Kai, dead. You want to know why I became Supreme Kai? Because everybody else is dead. So stop acting like shit is sweet. So Boo starts admiring the scenery. So Bro's like, hmm. Time to assert my dominance. Oh, man. Oh, yeah. Right after he's done, he shoots a key blast immediately. So Vegeta stops it from hitting. And Goku's like, yo, this nigga was about to blow up the planet. So then Vegeta's like, hey, yo, try that again, nigga. I'm oh, cool. no. So Boo turns around and looks at him. He's like, alright, then. So he starts Bro. charging up a ginormous one. So Goku's like, yo, chill. The boo just smiles. Said, that man's a savage, bro. And blew up the world, bro. This man really just showed up. Blew up the planet for no reason at all. And didn't even say a word. You know, yep, he's always he did. saying, hmm, I'm going to destroy Earth. Reason. Well, I mean, he did do it in Resurrection after, but he did it like a Cell, I'm gonna blow up the Earth, and there's nothing you can do. Fair. Mm -hmm. Bro didn't even say a word. He just did it. I mean, we should have known he was about that life when the first episode he shows up in is called The End of Earth. So Damn. after this, this man rebuilds himself almost immediately, learns instant transmission, then starts going from planet to planet, Blowing up every single one searching for Goku and Vegeta. Man said that fate is not running away from me. So then Boo does one of the craziest things I have ever seen. And this is where he submitted himself in my books as the ultimate menace. He went to heaven to beat the bricks off a of dead guy. Yeah. I beg your pardon? He went to go get more smoke from the dead ops. Look at Kulun and Yamcha. That's like, crazy, oh my bro. God, bro. Ain't no way this is happening right now. Who said F that rest in peace? I'm whooping that ass again. So this man starts beating bricks off of everybody. Oh my God, bro. bro. With a three piece combo, then started suplexing him with his antenna. So now this man is ready to wipe everybody from existence. But then Bruh. he sees Goku and Vegeta again, and he's like, oh, time to go. I'm like, bro, imagine you are in heaven resting for eternal peace and you see your outcome trying to get some more yeah stuff. like bruh that that's just out that's savagery so man he pulls up to the kai world and he's like ah yes <laughs> my fade so he starts fighting goku and while he's fighting this man this man starts emoting laughing and dancing while he's bruh. fighting this man look bro can't even form words but he's still talking <laughs> you bitch nigga but ladies and gentlemen, mm, mm, mm. what we really have to get to though is the absolute violation, absolute ass whooping he whooping gave. Whooping they ass, bro. God, he was pulling this man. Mm. He was saying, hmm, looks like I'm gonna have to make your hairline more f***ed up than it already is. <laughs> so, it ends up getting laid out. <laughs> but then he ends up getting back up, so who's like, hmm, so you wanna be a black Air Force, huh? I then consider this. Initiation. So Bruh ends up in his and his spine. And then he said, Go on, go It started choking the life out of me. Oh my <laughs> god. Oh my god. <laughs> and that was all she wrote for Vegeta. He, he was done. So then Mr. Satan wanted some smoke, but. Mm. Come on, Bruh. Mm -mm. <laughs> so then Fat Boo pulls up. So Kid Boo, like, mm -hmm. Booga Booga Booga. If it isn't the big ass bubble gum shrimp looking mother, so we just started welling on Fat Boo. Bro is welling on himself. He is fading the good version mm. of himself. Look at him. Bro decided to take a whole time out on him. Then he grabs him and starts gut checking him. Mm. I'm about to make you lose your breakfast, lunch, and your dinner. And Fat Boo is done too. So the way they had to beat this man is just absolutely mind boggling. 
They had to get everybody, the whole damn earth, to give this man Goku some energy so he could extinguish this damn menace. Damn. As he started to push it back, but the plot kicked in, and the ultimate menace was slain. Damn. That's tough. Yeah. And ladies and gentlemen, that is why little homie sits in the front. Like, yeah. The stuff he was doing was just unexplainable. He faded the entire cast, blew up the earth on the first episode he showed up in, faded his ops in heaven, as well as deleting the entire human population. <laughs> Dog. So yeah, that's basically it. So uh, hope y'all enjoy. Make sure to follow your boy on IG and Twitter. I'll have the poll up for the next video the day after this is uploaded. And, yeah, uh, that... That was a crazy video, bro. Man, let me know what y'all think, man. But yeah, Majin Buu was a freaking menace, bro. Man, I forgot how much shit he did, bro. But man, make sure y'all like the video. Subscribe if you're new. I'll see you on the next one. And this is SK the King signing out. Peace. And I'm out.